Hi all, my name is Shini Devakar and I am from the Cybercare YouTube channel. Today I am going to tell you a very wonderful tool for Android mobiles. With this tool actually you can perform rela network related things from your phone only, no need of computer anymore. So you may be following my other videos if you are a returning subscriber like the discover thing actually. If you are a new subscriber you may not know what I am talking about. It's very simple. I just want to show you how can you turn your mobile into a network discovery thing. Fine, you can perform all network related, most of the network related stuff right from your mobile. So for all this stuff actually all you need to do is go to play store and remember for this practical or for this thing you don't need a rooted phone. It's It can be compatible with almost any android phone. So go to play store and search for Fing. FING FING you can see that from overlook we have network tools FING actually so select that and install FING is a very good tool actually it's a very lightweight tool and it's very easy to get and it's very, to, very easy to use also so after installing this FING what you do is just open it so right now it is scanning my device and with the Wi-Fi actually it is scanning you can see I have three Wi-Fi devices here one is my phone and one is my router and the last one is a computer from Intel actually which means your device can perform network detections uh, like network scanning actually network detection scans through which you can find out other devices which are connected to the same Wi-Fi fine so let me connect to any other Wi-Fi and let me see what happens I have a lot of Wi-Fi here I hacked into one of my neighbor's Wi-Fi so I have that Wi-Fi connection also so what I will do is I'll just go to this thing again and here I'll do just do scanning again you can see that my Wi-Fi detected as G1 and you can see I have Apple device here and here and this one is invincible and this is my phone and this guy PC name is Horn High Precision and this is D-Link and the Samsung mobile available so like that as soon as you connect it to a Wi-Fi network, you can scan them and you can find them what are their IP addresses and other details. Let's say I want to know other details about this Vasu actually. So I want to know what I like NetBIOS name. Like, let me just tap it. So you can see other details, IP address, MAC address and the MAC address vendor and NetBIOS name, NetBIOS domain, NetBIOS role. If you don't know about NetBIOS name actually, it's just a computer name. So whatever you keep your computer name actually and that would be your NetBIOS name and this thing actually first seen only today because just now I scanned. So there are some other things also available called logs and scanning services pinging like that which means you can directly ping. Let's, let's, let me show you this ping thing actually so let me select ping you can see that automatically it is pinging and if anything goes wrong it will tell you so far there is no pack, packet loss available you can see and maximum ping is it is doing two pings minimum two pings and maximum is 42 pings for an average it is doing six pings actually no packet loss means ping is enabled there which means you can simply do a ping scan fine similarly you can scan for ports also here it is scan for services you select that whatever ports are open on the target machine you can get to know with this tool which means this ping tool is a direct actually actually not a direct actually it's a most common used alternative for your nmap tool fine so there are three services available and you can see we have connection methods also for this one wherever you have this thing actually this uh, this arrow kind of thing for a port number you can directly connect or you can test a tcp connection see i uh, let me try something like hi uh, I don't think it's receiving my connections because this is a mobile similarly we have some other computers I can do trace route and I can see log for this it requires another software okay let me go for this D-Link let me see what are there so scan services I'm going to scan the services there are FTP SSH telnet and HTTP so why can't I try for FTP 
connect with FTP client okay it requires FTP client so that I can connect into that FTP similarly I have a search telnet HTTP let me see HTTP open browser you can directly open that router panel into your screen uh, if you have the password or something you can just go on like, let me try with default password okay no problem so like that you can do a lot more things by just using an app in your phone no need of computer no need of Kali Linux or no need of any other port scanning tools fine all you can do at your fingertips using this thing tool actually fine so all you have to do is whenever you connect to a network just scan the PCs and find out what ports they are having and you know what to do next like vulnerability scanning and finding out exploits etc etc so thanks for watching this video if you like this video you may also like my other videos uh, you can go to uh, youtube.com slash the cyber care to get all my videos like wi-fi hacking and facebook session hijacking and buffer overflow and other things like a lot of things are there like creating trojans creating viruses and a lot of network related stuff available you can just go on and you can learn there and if you like this videos you just like it or if you don't like it tell me what you like so that i can make that video in my next video attempt actually so subscribe for more updates on my channel thank you thanks for watching this video